Hello, welcome to my first tool tutorial. In this tutorial, we'll be going over the welding tool. So basically, the welding tool allows you to fuse two props together. For example, you left click on the first prop, left click on the next prop. What this does is it connects them together in a rigid sort of setup. As you can see, there is a little bit of movement if you put enough force on it, but this weld won't break. Now, you can right click with the weld tool and you can attach a prop to another prop like so and it will allow me to rotate I press right click again and it freezes it in place now it doesn't matter how far away a prop is if you t use the weld tool and you weld two props together like so it will still attach it the same way now one thing I've got to note here once you weld two, two props together you I when I first started this I would weld like this and I would think that was making a difference, but it doesn't actually make a difference. You can only weld stuff once. Uh, additionally, you can use the force limit if you like. So force limit, you can set it to whatever value you want. You can type in a million or whatever. But basically, if you take a prop, let's just get a new prop out. If you weld it with a force limit, if you put enough force on it, it breaks the weld. If you uh, have two props that are welded together and you wish to unweld them, click the prop, click on one of the props with R, and as you can see, it unwelds them from each other. Just a quick note: if you have a big group of props that are welded together like so, and you unweld one, of, like I'll just give you an example, weld this to everything. As you can see, it's all connected. If I press R with the weld tool on here, it will remove all the welds from this object. So everything else will be as it was, but everything attached to this will no longer be attached. No collide is the same. If you have the no collide set on and you weld two props together like this, say we just leave it like that, what you'll notice is these can pass through each other. You can weld as many props together as you like. You can weld this prop to this prop and this prop to this prop. They will all be together. If you do notice that things are moving around a little bit, you can always weld everything together like that. And that's a little bit more rigid. So I encourage you to mess around with this. Um, find out whatever works. And thanks for watching this tutorial.